And then we get a wide shot of the action in the entire Adar Aliyah Sports Complex. You want boxing, you've come to the right place. There's more boxing than you can handle. The A ring has bouts going on all day. The B ring has bouts going on all day. This is nothing but pure, pure amateur, unadulterated boxing. Danabek Sushanov from Kazakhstan making his way to the ring now. He'll be boxing out of the red corner, just 27 years old. 181 centimeters tall. And his opponent from the U.S. of A, Jesse Hart, 22 years old. Standing at 186 centimeters tall. This is going to be a good one as well. Folks, we are nothing but at the highest level of amateur boxing. Dorian Buttar from Sweden is the referee for this contest. Tedek, Sinar, Basi, Gallagher, and Hassan are the judges from around the world that will be scoring the punches for this contest. Danabek Sushanov. He took third place at the 2010 Asian Games in Gansu Province, China. He took first place gold at the Kazakh National Championships in 2011 and again a bronze at the 2011 Nurma Gambetov tournament in Almaty, Kazakhstan. And Jesse Hart, 2009 USA National Championship silver medalist. He was also the 2011 USA National Golden Gloves tournament gold medalist. He was the gold medalist at the 2011 USA National Championships as well as the gold medalist at the USA National Olympic Trials. That's what put him here today. He's from Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. He's coached by Cyclone Hart, his father, and as we get ready to start the action, and of course by head coach of the USA boxing team, Joe Zanders. As boxing is ready to resume here in the B ring, Jesse Hart out of the US in the blue corner, Susanov from Kazakhstan out of the red corner. And Hart pops out that left hand. He's tall, he's lean, he's spry. Susanov with a high guard and a tight defense. All the Kazakhstani boxers I've ever seen box are top notch. They're trained by the best. They start at an early age and they never stop training. Susanov has a mission in mind and hearts in the way. Can he break his heart? We shall see. Jesse Hart, does he have enough? We shall see. Right now it's been a little bit of a chess match as both boxers trying to find their angle, trying to find their way in each other, looking for an opportunity to land the first real meaningful punch of the bout. A minute's gone by and neither boxer has really gotten off just yet. Hart's got his back to the corner now as he circles to his right. The referee calls a break in the action and now boxing resumes. And now Sujanov throws a left to the body and they lock up in the middle. Hart tries to throw a left hand through the guard and the referee issues a caution to not use his shoulder. It's against the rules in Aiba regulated boxing matches as in most boxing matches. And now a right hand by Hart a clubbing right to the left temple of Susanov, and Susanov starts to walk his man down. Susanov using baby jabs to try and get his rhythm. A lunging right by Hart, a left hand by Susanov. And Susanov continues to move forward with J Hart doing an excellent job of using that long rangey jab. Jesse Hart back against the ropes, and here's Susanov. They lock up in the middle. The clinch is on, and Jesse Hart but being pushed back by the rangy Danabek Sujanov. And now the referee is going to let a break take place while the corner of Jesse Hart adjusts the chin strap to his headgear. And boxing resumes. Jesse Hart throws out a quick jab. And there's another. And another, a left right combination. And they lock up, and Sujanov starts throwing right clubs to the head of Hart while Hart escapes harm's way. And now here comes Susanov again, and Hart doing a good job staying out of harm's way. The Susanov trying to step right into the lion's den, trying to bring the fight and force the action upon Jesse Hart. Jesse Hart now taking a moment, 
Circling to his left, a quick right hand by Sujanov, fired out. And another right hand, chopping right, and another right hand by Sujanov, and Hart is able to escape them all. Left-right combination by Hart, and back comes Sujanov with a left-right of his own. Once again, Hart backpedals, and Sujanov continues to bring the action to him. A right hand by Sujanov, scores on the chin of Hart. Left hand by Sujanov, as Sujanov continues to walk his man down, and Hart looking to circle to the right, and left hand jab, and another left hand to punctuate the round, and that is the end of the first. Good excitement here in Baku, Azerbaijan, as the corner of Danabek Sujanov tenders to their man. You could see some action here as Sujanov charges forward, and Hart, with his hands up high, uses his crafty footwork to stay out of harm's way. And there's a left hand by Sujanov. And you see Coach Joe Zanders tending to his man, Jesse Hart, and that's five to three the score is after round number one. So Jesse Hart is able to escape with a two-point lead going into round number two. And now we get set for action to resume round number two. Danabek Shushanov from Kazakhstan, Jesse Hart from the United States of America. The winner of this bout goes on to the quarterfinal round tomorrow. This is an elimination style tournament. The loser goes home. And as a consolation prize to the winner, he also gets, oh yeah, a ticket to the 2012 London Summer Olympics. Left right by Hart, or right by Sujanov. And now Sujanov locking up and a chopping right hand by Hart with another one by Sujanov right back in return. So Sujanov is starting to get into his rhythm. He's bobbing and weaving and now he's got Hart up against the ropes and Hart escapes and he throws a right hand as he circles off the ropes. And now they're back in the center of the ring and Hart throws a left right combination. And there's a right hand by Sujanov. And now Hart looks for an opportunity, and Sujanov won't let him have it. Sujanov keeps his left hand wrapped around the side of Hart and continues to keep throwing with his right, and the referee is going to separate the boxers once again. Left-right combination by Hart. And here comes Sujanov charging forward, and now Sujanov finds himself with his back against the ropes, and Hart is being pulled aside by the referee and once again issued a caution to keep his hands up. Here comes the hard charging Sujanov and a nice strong stiff jab by Jesse Hart. And there's a right hand by Hart and Jesse's able to escape harm's way and Sujanov now looking a little befuddled, a little confused. He lunges forward, throws a left hand, does Sujanov and a left right left combination. Blistering hands by Jesse Hart as he throws a three punch combination to keep the hard charging Sujanov off of him. And now Jesse Hart circling to his right, then back to his left, clinching in the center of the ring. We're halfway through round number two. And Hart continues to play defensive maneuvers with Hart, uh, excuse me, with Sujanov, as Sujanov takes a slight slip and the referee instructs him to wipe off his gloves. And here comes Sujanov. A little wrestling going on in the center of the ring, but Hart is once again instructed by the referee to not use his shoulder. And now the two go toe to toe and Hart seems to get the better of it. Sujanov falls back just a bit. There's a snapping left hand, then another by Jesse Hart and a third with a right hand to follow. And that right hand by Hart is deceivingly powerful. He's got long arms and he gets full extension on those punches and when he does, it's gotta hurt. Except Sujanov doesn't feel pain right now. He can't, there's too much adrenaline running through his blood. He knows what's at stake, there's 30 seconds left. He's down on the scorecards going into this round and here comes Cart Hart clubbing away with left and right and Sujanov comes back with a right of his own. And once again, the referee issues a caution to Hart and boxing resumes a Hart charging. Sujanov throws a right hand off the break and now they separate one more time. Left right combination followed by a Clubbing double left hook by Jesse Hart to the temple of Sujanov. 
A wild right hand, a haymaker, if you will, by Jesse Hart. Misses its mark, and now they lock up again in the center of the ring, and Sujanov is trying to break free by using his left and his right to the midsection of Jesse Hart. And finally, the referee has seen enough, and he's going to issue a warning to Jesse Hart, and that's going to put two extra points in the pocket of Danabek Sujanov. Two well-needed points as he came in down by a couple going into this round, and both boxers ex exchange blows as the bell is sounded. And this is going to be a very close one, folks, because it looked pretty close going in. You add the two-point warning for Sujanov, and what you have is the mix for a potentially dramatic final round. We see some action from the last round as both boxers are not afraid to let their hands go as often as they can. Punches and bunches from both boxers, and you saw Hart get the slightly better of the exchange right there. And as we await the score, it was 6-4 Susanov, and that makes it 9-9. So this is an extremely close one. It can't get closer. We're going into the third round. It's like going into the first round of a one-round fight. This is anyone's right now. The referee, he knows what's at stake. He's ready to get these boxers going, to touch gloves in the center of the ring or not, just to start boxing, and here they go. Susanov knows it's a tie score. Jesse Hart knows it's a tie score. Who could land more punches? Who could impress the judges more? Sujanov comes charging forward, and here comes Hart with a sneaky left hook around the high guard of Sujanov. Sujanov presses the action, and down goes Hart, although it was likely a slip. Will he be able to get up? Yes, he will. The referee's gonna have him dry off his gloves, and they meet back in the center of the ring. A right hand by Hart, and Hart says, come on, bring it on. Hart is feeling the excitement right now. He's worked very hard. He's been boxing since he was a youngster. He's a student of the game. He's watched more footage of the old timers than most old timers themselves. Jesse Hart has been born into this sport and he's not about to let all of that hard work and all of that preparation slip away, not today. There's two minutes, 15 seconds left to go and now the boxers are trading blows in the center of the ring. Here comes Kazakhstan moving forward, but the United States of America is putting up a united front. Jesse Hart will not give an inch. And now he turns Sujanov and Sujanov back against the ropes. He is issued a caution by the referee for turning his back. And now Sujanov right off the break with a right hand to the chin of Hart. A right hand by Sujanov. Hart not giving him any room to breathe. He's staying on him like a wet blanket. Hart's going to need to get some separation if he's going to be able to land some power punches at the end of those long arms. Sujanov needs to stay inside. He needs to stay on the chest of Hart. This is Sujanov's style if he could stay on the chest of Hart and land those short chopping punches to the body. Hart, on the other hand, is going to need to step away and get some distance so he can really get some snap in his punches. The referee is going to issue another warning to Jesse Hart. Oh my, this could be the fatal blow to Jesse Hart's dreams right now. That's another two points that he now has to come back from. And he could right there with two great punches that land square on the chin of Sujanov. The same two points Jesse Hart just gave up with a warning. He took right back with two clean, solid shots to the chin of Danabek Sushanov. So now the boxers are very likely all tied up again here with just a minute to go in the third round. Boy, this is one of the most exciting bouts we've seen all day. Sushanov and Hart. And Sushanov is now going to be cautioned by the referee. And Hart comes clubbing away with lefts and rights. Sushanov coming back with a right of his own. This is Sushanov's best chance of winning if he could keep Hart close. Keep Hart's long arms wrapped around him while he batters away like a battering ram with his lefts and rights. And here comes Hart. Leaving it all on the table are these boxers. Sujanov. He'd be well served to go to the body when they're in those clinches while Hart's big arms are draped around him like that. He's free to let his hands go to the body. Why not? He's not doing it. And Hart, why is he letting this action take place so close why is he not pushing off and getting the distance he needs to land the proper blows the answers to these questions are anybody's guess however one thing's for sure is these two boxers are really really here to impress the crowd they're here to uh, take the glory 
home with them. They're here to represent their countries and their fans. And most of all, they're here to go to the London Olympics. There's just a few seconds left. This has been a grudge match the entire bout. This third round, the rubber round, if you will. And that's it, folks. The third round is in the books. This bout is history, except one thing. We don't know the conclusion yet, but we are about to find out. Jesse Hart, the look of exasperation as his head coach, Joe Zanders, pats him on the back of the head, a consoling, consoling tap saying, don't worry, kid, you gave it your all. We know he did, and so did Sujanov. The tension right now is so thick we could cut it with a knife. Who will be the winner? There's chance of USA going on. There's chance of Kazakhstan going on from the crowd. And the winner is Danabek Sushanov from Kazakhstan. Wow, what a close one. 17 to 15, Danabek Sushanov. Very exciting to say the least. We could look at some action back here and you could probably put it on that two point warning we spoke about earlier. Jesse Hart gave away two. We thought he got him back with a quick flurry right afterwards, but perhaps the judges saw it differently. This was an exciting bout from beginning to end. Both boxers threw as much as they ate, but only one could come away with the victory, and it was Danabek Sushanov. Congratulations. You are representing Kazakhstan in the 2012 Olympics.